All right, welcome back to another Google Earth Guru video. This time it's gonna be an advanced tip for my military personnel watching. Let's take a look. So there's a website called symbol.army slash symbol that I'll, and I'll leave the link to in the description of this video. What you can do with this is create custom symbols and ops graphics save them as a PNG, and then visualize them in Google Earth. The way this thing works is you have the magnifying glass right here to do a search. Here I can type in things like infantry, and I can find my infantry symbol, go to it, and then even edit it further. Here I can change the affiliation if I want this to be a hostile infantry symbol. Give it an echelon if I want to make it a battalion size element. And then these other fields, I can put all the other types of information that you can learn about 2525 Delta uh, publication. I can also do a search for nuclear. And I can find nuclear facilities, all sorts of things. Armor. In this case, I think I'm going to do, I want to visualize a complex attack in Iraq. A complex attack is composed of an IED and an ambush. So first, I'm going to search for IED. Do a search. Here's my IED explosion symbol. I'm gonna to go to it, but I need to edit it to make it a hostile IED event. So I'm gonna change the affiliation. I can give it a date time group. We'll say this happened yesterday. And I can give it more information, like maybe call it a command wire IED. Now that I've got the, the symbol that I want, I'm going to download it. I'm going to save this PNG right here. And I'll bring that in shortly. I also want to visualize the ambush. So I'll go back to the magnifying glass, look up ambush, do my search. Here's my ambush symbol, ops graphics. But I need to change the affiliation to make it a hostile ops graphic. And now I'm going to save this. Now it's time to visualize this in Google Earth. So here I am in northern Iraq, Mosul. Let's say this complex attack happened down here along this road near this uh, creek. What I'm going to do is add a place mark. And when I go to the icon palette, I'm going to come down here to add custom icon. This is where I'm going to browse to where I saved that IED. Here it is. Get rid of the label. I might want to make that a little bit bigger so people can see it. There we go. And now I'm going to move it right there. Click OK when I'm happy with it. Now I need to some, uh, visualize the ambush. So I'm going to add this time an image overlay. Browse to my picture for the ambush. There it is. Now I need to adjust it. I'm going to change the size. Tilt it. Let's say the ambush came from this creek right there. When I'm happy with it, click OK. And now I've visualized this complex attack 
involving an IED and using ops graphics for the ambush symbol. So when you're doing the symbols, they need to be place marks. If you're doing ops graphics, they need to be image overlays because the size, width, and orientation is all very important, and that needs to be an image overlay. Thanks for watching, and map your world.